I said in my last video that God took his time to create Africa so it's about time each and every African out there to grab and cherish the continent like the way you grab and cherish your woman it's a blessing to be from Africa it's exactly seven o'clock in the morning and I woke up to enjoy such a beautiful sunrise man I mean the air you breathe in in Africa is something that you can never compare to the air you breathe in the West I'm not here to compare but I'm here to tell Africans that it's time to revisit your roots learn to explore your own continent like traveling within 17 African countries I must conclude that God lives in Africa so if you want to And the thing is that it's African. I love how they have used the wood on the houses. Oh my goodness. You know, it's full of, you know, trees. You see green. It's so beautiful. You have the fish, you know. And, and that's and, why it's called And aqua. there are fishes everywhere. Exactly. And we have the lake. Mm -hmm. So even if you stay here, you still have the view of the lake. Exactly. I mean, pools everywhere. Uh, oh my goodness. It's so soothing, you know. It's the, like therapeutic. Do you understand? Oh, oh therapeutic. Therapeutic. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you just need to come to places. Maya. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Wow. You're welcome to Aqua Safari Resort. Thank you so much, man. Can Thank I say something? Yes, say it. You're gorgeous. Thank just you. like Aqua Safari. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> but I just want to know, Aqua Safari is owned by a Ghanaian? Yes, it's owned by a Ghanaian, Mr. Samo Afari Date. That's a Ghanaian wow. name. That's a Ghanaian name. Yes. You know why I asked you that? Because yes. people have been saying that everything in africa is owned by lebanese chinese no. and the white people no so i'm so glad you're telling me that the owner 
It's a Ghanaian. Yes. But why the name Aqua Safari? Aqua Safari came from his name. His wow. Mr. Samuel Afari Date. So the S comes from Samuel mm. and Afari. So Aqua Safari. Now I understand. Yes. Because I was at Safari Valley. Wow. And Safari Valley also has the word safari. Safari, yes. Wow, it's good to know. Yeah. What's the first ever project that they did in here? Um actually, you see where we are standing here? Yeah. You saw a wetland. The whole place is waterlogged. So before I got involved in this project, I, I used to live uh, just across the river bank. Okay. So I always commute. Anytime I'm commuting, I keep seeing structures coming, putting up. All the time I see structures. So I was a bit curious and I want to find out who is behind the structures. Mm. And when I came, I liked what I saw. It makes sense to me. And I realized with or without me, the structures are going to come up. So I spoke to someone after that for only 10 minutes and it blew my mind. Wow. It's not what he has done by that time. That was about seven years ago. But what he's about to do. He told me this was the only building, like a family house for himself and this pool. That's the, that's the reason why he came here, to come and enjoy. And later, friends were coming. Okay. So he decided to put up another three riverfront chalet for vacation homes for the friends. Before he realized he has to go commercial. So oh. he put up another 16 deluxe rooms and then another six chalet. Today, as I'm speaking to you, we've got over 150 rooms. Wow. The rest of the story, please, I'll have to leave you to, to, meet, to, to meet the guy himself. And he's going to tell oh, me Oh, yeah, more. yeah, trust me. Wow. Hey, I'm seeing incredible stuff that I've never seen before. Mm -hmm. What is this building behind us? It's a ship-like capsized building for our conferences. Wow. It takes about 300. Through the sea? Yes. That's incredible. And what is in front of us? It's a ship like, a ship -like building. Mm -hmm. This is where our first reception was. Oh, okay. Yes, before we are where we are now. So you started from here? Before, before we got to where we are one. now, yes. That's incredible. I think Mr. Afari has a story to tell yes. the world. Yes. What is this beautiful one that I'm seeing? Buffer Falls. Buffer Falls? Yes. And, and we, what is over there? Um, we have pelicans, we have tortoise, and we give you access for you to feed them feed the pel pelicans when you're here. Wow. Yes. Can't wait to feed them. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Great. Hello. Welcome to Aqua Safari Resort. Thank, Thank you. Anyway, so I'm much. Godwin Gao. I'm the environment supervisor and I'm going to take you through the feeding of the fish and also the feeding of the pelican today. All right. So um, welcome to the horses. Yes. You will do the horse riding later. Okay. So um, welcome to Buffer Falls. So here okay. in Aqua Safari, we have, we try to create concept. The whole concept and the whole idea is about Aqua and Safari. All right, so aqua. Aqua refers to the water features. That's why when they come here, we have the fish ponds and also the enclavements mm. and the water fountains. That's the aqua aspect of the place. And also the safari, which I call the safari experience. That's the animals. So when you come here, we have the horses in the free range system, the donkeys and also the peacocks and the peahens also in the free range system. All right, so welcome to one of the enclavements we've created here for the water beds. All right, so the water beds here, we have the great white pelican and in here, we call here the buffer falls. So the great white pelican, the range is in Africa, Asia, and Europe. That's where you can find the great white pelican. And also the habitat is freshwater lakes, marshes, swamps, and dishes. That's where you see the great white pelican. So the diet is fish. So we feed it tilapia once a day at one.
us. Thank you. And um, this is where our waterfront, the chalets, and the deluxe rooms are located. Amazing. We have six chalets, we have three waterfront, mm. and 16 deluxe rooms located here, and three at the reception. Wow. Yes. So whatever name you find on the on on the rooms over here mm -hmm. are the things that Mr. Afari saw when he came here. Are you kidding me? So yeah. what are the names that you have in here? We have bat. We have bat? yes. We have <laughs> mosquito. That's so incredible. so this is a mosquito room. Wow. Yes. Okay. And then we have lobster. Mm. We have anko. Mm. Yes. We also have hook. And I like the fact that they planted trees. Yes. I mean, like, it's perfect place to live. Natural place. Wow. When you come to Aqua Safari, yeah. we take care of you from the room, mm -hmm. from food to activities. From food to activities? Yes. We I'm have much our more interested in the food. Right. We have our restaurant, mm -hmm. and then we have our live kitchen too as well. Wow. We have bath. Please, I want to know, do I have breakfast, lunch, and dinner? You have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yes, but it depends on the package you are on before you can have the three meals. I want that package with the three okay. meals. Okay. The only resort in Ghana that fed me with my favorite dish. The excitement on my face alone says it all. This is fufu. And in this slice soup, it got... No, you know, people don't know why I'm excited, man. People don't know why I'm excited. This is what I've been talking about all this while. Kako. Maya, did you come here alone? Why would I come to such a beautiful place alone? Right, because here in Aqua Safari Resort, mm. we have so many activities that will make your stay memorable. Wow. Yes. So what goes on in here? We have the water park activities, mm. which is the jet ski. Do you know that this water has sharks? Really? Yeah, they got like small baby sharks in there. That's insane. Yeah. Oh, the white one. Oh, Look at that one. Shark, That's yeah. crazy. Exactly. But hey, we were supposed to spend just a day. And we ended up spending a whole week. What was your favorite activity in here? Mine was jet ski. Oh, wow. What was yours? Me? I think I'll go for the water park. Oh really? Yeah. Why the water park? I mean we had more fun in there, even though I don't know how to swim. Mm -hmm. The the trainer made me so comfortable with the water. Yeah, for the first me time I showed you moving one moving meter in the pool. And, ah, it was not one I'm meter. so it proud was of one you. Kilometer. One meter. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. One meter. Uh, what all I'm gonna tell you guys is that 
And if you're looking for a honeymoon destination, this is a perfect place to come. If you're looking for a place to hang out during the weekend, this is a perfect place to come. If you're looking <laughs> for a place to go and hide so that your family members don't know where you are, look no further. This is a perfect place to come. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys like the video. And don't forget to go to her YouTube channel, subscribe, and be part of her family too. It's your boy, Mr. Ghana, baby. And, and your girl, Miss Trudy. And I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye. Peace out.